Howdy y'all, this is Raymond's Raven, and welcome back to Cozy Grove. So last time, um, the people that I helped, we only had a few people to help last time, and most of the people wanted, like, filler quests done, so um, a little anticlimactic after the meeting of Pius of Greece. So, Grizz. I mean, Grizz, Grizz, Pious of Grizz, Pious of Grease, um, I think it's Grizz because Grizzly, right? Um, but the main thing was that we got, we fi I finally finished um, some of the stuff for the pictures and so Bala had another picture he wanted us to find. And apparently it was a really dark picture, and it was blackened out and stuff. Supposed to be like kind of evil, and, or had something really bad that happened with it. And it's Francesca's. So because she's the wood bear and she's really big into the wood woods and stuff, um, I thought it was like it was burnt. So that's a that's a thing that the main thing that I can think of that we had happen last time. Um, other than that, yeah, we're all ready, we're all good to go. So I went through and did what collecting I could. If I missed something, we will go ahead and collect that. And we will get in and get started for today. So first thing, I want to buy the spirit log for today. Yes, I will buy it. And I think we're all good. Okay. Let's go ahead and turn this in real quick. And then there are a few main people that I'm pretty sure we need to help today. So, Lee, I need to help today. Um, he wants something. Patrice has a exclamation point. I'm not sure if that's for... He has a quest or if it's for mail. So I do want to see him for that. Allison. And then Clyde. Allison because I have a list of things that I need to um, bake for animals and stuff. And then Clyde. He hasn't wanted anything for a few days now. So it's like... He wants something. Let's jump on it. Other than that, we'll help uh, going based on who we feel like helping. So let's go on ahead and jump in. Lee, can I help you with something today? When you get to collecting as much stuff as I do, it's inevitable that at some point you invest in a metal detector. No, no, don't get excited, friend. That thing is long gone. But I do remember one of those. Clovers made the detector beep up a storm once upon a time. Never dug it up, though. You don't look too busy. Mind poking around, boy? Clover? Look for a five-leaf clover and dig it up. A five-leaf clover? A what? Where? That's a bug. Um, a five-leaf clover? I have no idea what he's talking about. I'm guessing it's a dig spot, but still. this. No idea what he's talking about though. First time I've heard of anything to do with a five-leaf clover. Uh, is that because we have new space? Like, 
buddy then. Leave me alone, mosquito. Five-leaf clover, buddy. Okay, then. Hi. Uh, is it supposed to be within your space? Because I... Charlotte then, because I'm, I'm just not seeing, I'm not understanding. Uh, let's just accept this real quick. Did you know that with the proper spirit scout training, you can read a ghost mind? Let me demonstrate. I'm thinking of something that grows. Can you bring me what I'm imagining? Yeah, I can bring that one. You got it exactly. Hey, I know exactly what you're thinking too. Where's my reward, right? Not particularly, I'm thinking, can you show me where this thing is? Because I'm a little lost. Okay, it's over there. But I kind of want this bug. No, come back. Fine. Okay. At least her quest wasn't too difficult. So I can go on ahead and find where this is. Oh, it is on the beach. Okay. Oh, there's a few over here. Okay, yeah. There were there were several over here. I just hadn't gone over here. I didn't think it was on the beach because it said clover. something. I oh, know, just the place for this. I appreciate your honesty. You could have just pocketed the darn thing. Here's a little something from the farm. Okay. And it's a new tree. Pretty sure I have two of those. So let's see. Uh, actually, what do you have today? Young sad deer. Young spectral bird. A mature forest bird. I don't think I've had anyone ask for mature. I have not seen one being sold before. Alright, I think that deer doesn't want anything, which is different, at least. I think it has been a few days since it wanted something, so that's fine. Clyde, you haven't asked for anything in a few days. So I most definitely am helping you today. Also, I wanted to mention, in case y'all hear me scribbling or something, um, I have a list beside me so I don't forget what word, what I have on my agenda for today. Alright, Clyde. Can I help you with something? It's chaos out there, kid. Beautiful chaos. Cozy Grove is marinating in pesky imps and low credit scores. The town is financially insolvent. And I didn't need to break one of the mayor's 3,000 ordinances to make it happen. It's time, kid. We're going to acquire the town deed. The mayor has it. She'll see the writing on the wall. Be able to get it from her on the cheek. Help Valentina and you'll get this in return. You may have to help multiple times and wait several days, so be patient. 
Well, no wonder. No wonder he was waiting. Okay, then. <laughs> Ooh, I like that one. And then... We have... The imp figures. The paintings. And then the TVs. Okay. Well... I will help Valentina today, so we're gonna put her as needs to be helped. Alrighty. Uh, so we're gonna work our way across the island, going from person to person that I have on the list. Allison, how can I help you today? I made a huge mess in the kitchen again, but I have no way to clean it up. You hid your broom from yourself again. Over here. There you are. There you are. Come here. Here. There we go. Nice. Why do you keep hiding it from yourself, Allison? I know you don't like doing chores, I don't either, but... <coughs> you need to be done. Dang! I thought I hit that broom. I really have to clean this myself, huh? Being grown up is the worst. <laughs> yes, it is. Alright. Got some good stuff. Not any of the things I needed. So, let's see. I need... One of these. Okay. And then that'll take five minutes, so let's see. And this. And then the only other thing that I have on the list is the couple of imps that want the bonbons. Yeah, bonbons. And um, I could get up to that amount. I think I could. I don't know what that is. Um, But I'm gonna wait just a little bit to see what we're gonna, if, how we're gonna do that. So for now, ooh, I could catch you. Nice. Plant fluid bug. You are new. Oh, and then this tree. Yes, I have two of those. So let's learn this. Starlit Diner. Okay, and then... Yeah, so most of these need to go in storage. Uh, I want to burn this. space open for that bug. And it's a rare one, so it'll give us a good, good chunk. Yeah. Okay. There's a shell over here, right? Yeah. I also learned, um, I 
probably should have figured this out sooner. That we have some hotkeys for putting certain things back into our hands. Um, yeah. There we go. Uh, this way. And I probably could have been using it sooner, but I just wasn't thinking about it for some reason. So. Francesca is... She's not marked on my list for some reason, but I do want to help her because I need to recycle those. I've been sifting through the forest floor looking for traces of my old life, but all I found were broad, broad leaves and pine needles, woodworms and scat. Here, where are the traces of my old life? Aside from those four statues of my father's, I haven't seen any evidence that I exist. Isn't there a single picture? Anything? We have that. Look, on the back it says Francesca Duclaw. That's me. But the picture is a little bent and underexposed. In fact, it's basically pitch black. Huh. I wonder why. I thought it was burnt, but... Well, either I'm not much of a photographer. Or I took a perfect shot of a black cat blinking on a moonless night. Or there's some other explanation that has yet to reveal itself. Honestly, little Fauna, mystery is not my favorite genre. But I think that's exactly what's growing in this forest. Oh, okay. Another green gauge tree and a street lamp. Patrice has my letter for me. Hmm. I'm glad we got that already. What am I doing? First, I want to turn recycle these. Scout. For once, I have some mail I'd like you to send. It's a standard I I N Y F letter. I have no idea what that is. Probably because it's an O A original acronym of mine. It is not your fault. Okay. It doesn't have an address on it. You don't need to mail it today. When time is right for delivery, I think you'll know. Thank you, Postal Hopper. Thank you so much for your, for your service. Oh. Okay. Letter of Forgiveness. Oh, okay. What? Patrice? Check my mail. <laughs> Complete bare memory collections. We just finished all of Patrice's quests. I think we just had our first bear ascend. <laughs> you would think that delivering a postcard would be the easiest postal task, but in after life, postcards can be some of the heaviest burdens. Final goodbyes, bittersweet missives. Uh, sometimes it makes me wish for a good old fashioned nun. Possessed piano or a set of encyclopedias to carry. 
What is it called? Warm my spirit. Oh my goodness. I'm gonna cry. We finished all of Patrice's things. I think he's ascended. Oh my gosh. Okay. Oh goodness gracious. Uh. Oh my goodness. My heart. And he gave us something to deliver to someone, but I don't know who it's going to go to. Oh goodness. Okay, we, we've got to turn these in. Um, there's a log for you. Yes, I do have another log in my bag. Oh gosh. A letter addressed to Charlotte Pine. That's for Charlotte when she's ready. Okay then. Goodness gracious, <laughs> there's so much going on. Oh. I, I, I don't even know what to, oh gosh. <sighs> okay. Let's, let's, let's feed these birds. <laughs> <laughs> oh, why does this have to be so emotional? <laughs> glad that we were able to help him though. Like, he really needed it. Um, while I'm thinking about it, let's see what this is. It's just a giant shell. Shell model. Okay, so we'll go put that over by. Um, uh, Octavia later. There you are, bud. Uh, Patrice, you give me feels. Valentina. Ah. Can I help you with something today, Valentina? I'm starting to wonder. What is it about this town that draws in those imps? Glenn and Clyde Wallace, the wolf bear. Allison's been making food for them. <laughs> the wolf bear. Clyde? But he's such a fine, upstanding citizen. Every election, he gives me a sizable donation. But there must be something more. It is after life of ours. It's a strange place, full of riddles and hints. I wish I had some more information about those imps. Something concrete from an expert. Like an opposition report, or even a pamphlet. I have that. I have an imp pamphlet. Great job, assistant. You found it. The pamphlet reads, Imps are lost, hungry souls. They skitter through the afterlife, pursuing illusory goals. They are never satisfied. Imps are drawn into our world by pockets of negative energy, where they hunger and feed in an endless loop of unhappiness. That's a sad story, and a familiar one. Does this mean my perfect little town is a vortex of negative energy? I do have to admit, all those details I fussed over that I thought would help me sell this village to the rest of the world, those things never made me happy. They just made me hold on tighter. I wonder. What is it that I really need? What would make things better? Hmm. Learning to let go of it more. 
You don't have to hold on to the town. I mean, unfortunately, that's the cycle of things sometimes. Sometimes a town will flourish for a while, but then eventually there's no more interest, it dies down. That's what happened to um, a lot of port towns that used to have a good port and then all of a sudden no one was there anymore or something. So, there's nothing wrong, it's just sometimes that happens and sometimes you can't fix it or change it. It just, you know, it's something that goes on. Um, and there's almost absolutely nothing you can do to change it. Um, and then some of the, the ones that were on the old railroad stops that the railroad, um, the train doesn't stop there anymore or something. Like, it's sad, but that's the truth. They just, they don't stop at that spot no more. find a spot for this that's kind of right there. There you go. Okay. Okay. Um, Ursula, Octavia, Tram, and Pius. Oh, hey. So Pius is our newest ghost, so I would say we should definitely help him. Okay, there we go. Well met, young pilgrim. Have you come to learn more about our emperor? You must understand that he is central to our faith. His highness communicates directly with the hallowed spirits. Through him we receive their wisdom. Ah, once I was like you, pilgrim. A young foundling, abandoned by my earthly kin. Uh, I wouldn't say I was abandoned. I was left the steps of a monastery. Its monks raised me. Oh wow, is that why he likes the quill? Wow, that was really old. <laughs> Under their tutelage I learned the sacred pillars of our faith, chief among which was community service, the key to enlightenment. Do you wish to be enlightened, pilgrim? I have seen such waste strewn across around this island. Rectify this and your path to enlightenment will become clearer. Okay. A water tower. Stick piles. So he doesn't like litter. Okay. I can, I can get behind that. Uh, water tower? That's a silo. Since when do you have a silo? You usually have a water tower over here, isn't it? It's not here. Okay. So, by Lee. Okay. I'd say that bug looks new, but water tower, water tower. So windmills. Uh, there's a water tower. Stick pile. Front of my face. Uh, grass piles over by Ted. Okay. There we go. Uh, some hanging fish. That's over by Tram. Okay, so behind something. Got it. E. It's gonna blend right in with all of your. So 
of your stuff, isn't it? Or it's gonna be behind you. And I won't be able to see it. Definitely a woodshed. But we could go maybe a little bit further than we did before. Because it's in a different spot now. Okay. Oh, are we here? There it is. I am enlightened. You have performed excellently, young pilgrim. Mm -hmm. You are now ready to join our humble faith. Sure, I guess. Take this with my blessing. Henceforth, you are an acolyte of the Emperor's Church. Is it a hat? Oh no, it's a rope. Modest vestment for a training pe priest. Okay. I'm good. Thank you. Thank you. Go on ahead and collect all these, huh? look like that is all the time that I have for today. Um, I want to check. So, this, this. Yeah. So, this. So these are both green gauges. Okay. Um, 
that shell, I want to come over here by Ursula. That shell model, I guess. So like I said earlier, we are out of time. Um, we're gonna do this. Why not? Ooh. Nice. Okay. Yeah, we have a we have a nice cute little tent. Um, we have a ton of space, <laughs> and yeah, we're all good. Um, we do still have those three, two, that will help next time, Ursula, Octavia, and Tram. Um, we helped everyone else, and other than them, the people either had long-term quests or didn't want any. So, we'll have to go from there. I can't believe Clyde wants the town deed. We still have this quest from the captain. Um, and we finally got our first uh, ascension, I guess. And it was Patrice. And I, I am so glad it was him. So honored. He, he's the one that... I am just so glad that he eventually found peace and is ready to move on. Um, just, oh, he, he pulled at my heartstrings so much. Uh, so we're gonna leave it there. Uh, leave me a comment down below. Let me know what y'all think. Let me know what y'all think of Patrice being our first one and his um, forgiveness letter to Charlotte, of all people. I don't know who it's from, or why, but there's that. And uh, leave a like to help with the feeding of all the animals and the imps, and collecting all the bugs and fish and all that that we have to do each day. And subscribe to join me on continuing to help these guys to ascend the right way and not Charlotte's way and to join me on all the other adventures that we hope to go on in the future and I will see y'all in the next one thank y'all bye bye